you to as open presents with with me hi everyone and welcome back to my channel now I'm in a new setup because this is a very impromptu video I got this package in the mail and this is my second shop miss a package so I'm like here excited to get started so this stuff is more accessories. I got loads of liquid lipsticks and loads of other random stuff. A lot of people were commenting on my video how they wanted me to unpackage the package like on camera instead of just using stuff because <clears throat> they're actually really fun to watch. I don't know how fun they are to do. I'm going to try and not make loads of like plastic noise sounds and you don't need to be watching me opening up little plastic stuff. So I'm actually going to run and get a scissors. And I'll get a garbage bag, so give me a second. No tea. So it looks like everything I ordered is there. And I got 45 items. It's a lot. But it's a lot. So this is my package. Like they really do package it really, really well, so I'm gonna get into it. So this is the initial package. I'm just gonna take this off. I got a lot of crap. I don't know how to show you this. I'm trying to show you. Like, this is all the crap that I got. I'm just gonna start in no particular order. So, first things first, I got four packs of face wipes. Now, I got these last time and I really, really love them. So, I got two cucumber and two green teas. There's these little face wipes. So there is 15 in each of them. They don't sting my face. They take off your makeup and like they're perfect size for hand wipes. So I got four. <sighs> Super happy with those. And I actually really, really like them. So for a dollar, you gotta remember everything here is a dollar each too. So let's keep going. So next up is this thing. A fan. I know this is like the most non thing in the world. Oh my god. Actually, that's amazing. So, this is the fan. It's just a little flowery one. The designs weren't great. Oh my god. But it's like 30 degrees here in Vancouver. So, I need this cute little thing. All the shade. So, I decided to get some accessories as well because I actually don't own any accessories. I'm a very like not accessory person. I wear loads of rings and that's about it. So my first pair of earrings are these cute little bubbling things. I think I got a load of stuff with pom poms on because I think that um I think that trend is super cute. And I actually do have my ears first. So these are the first guys. Cute little puffy blue diamante danglies. Cute. This another accessories I got is this Choker, I think. With pom poms. I really don't remember picking this up. This is a little bracelet with other pom poms on it. So, this is a little pom pom bracelet. I must admit, I do not have the slimmest hands in the world. So, it does fit me. So, this does fit a wide range of hands. I'm gonna keep it on. Next up are another pair of earrings. And these are more pom poms. Like, I need to get off myself. But these have little dangly bits at the bottom. They're super cute. It'll encourage me to wear my hair up because I actually never do. And I think shopping is a great way to experiment with accessories and stuff because they're only still a dollar each. Remember, remember. So that's amazing. Great start. Great start. Okay. I'm trying to get all the accessories out of the way. So the next earrings I got are these. Now I hope you can see the color. These are beautiful. Their size, freaking hell. I really like these. So I think these are the type of earrings that one goes in the front and then it comes from behind. Still a dollar and they look really good and expensive. Nice. Nice. So another pair of earrings I got. I don't remember picking these up. But it's a pink and yellow version of those blue ones. Mm, really cute. I don't want to pick them up. Could I have them there? Next up, you guessed it, are an, is another pom pom accessory. But these are little hoops with little green pom poms. Oh, they're so cute. See them? And for a dollar. Even if you wore them once, these are a little bit more dangly. 
These are perfect for the summer, you know? You can buy your seasonal accessories. Super cute. So my last accessory is actually my favorite one I picked up. So this is a brown leather choker. Style D. But I think... Yeah, so this little thing can move up and down, you see? So it's like a western style one. And I have chokers like this, but they're in black. So I decided to pick up a brown. It's really cute! Oops. So, that's the end of jewelry accessories. So I have some makeup accessories here. This is, what is this do you think? This is actually, I don't have any nail polishes. This is actually a plastic ring that you put your nail polish into and then Oh, so you'd put it on your less dominant hand and instead of holding the bottle you put it in there and you paint your nails I think that's a brilliant idea and it's really good um, like I said I have the biggest fingers in the world and it fits, sits on it's not gonna go anywhere cute and there's loads of colors too so on my travels I also picked up a shit load of masks I'll just run through them I don't need to explain them so I got a coconut oil sheet mask, I got an oatmeal bubble mask, there's two in there, a hydrating sheet mask, a collagen sheet mask, a charcoal sheet mask, this is like a creamy coconut hydrating mask, okay, this is a peach bubble mask, there's two in there. Peach is my favorite flavor of anything, so I think there's a few peach favorites up here. A cucumber peely mask, an avocado sheet mask, that should be interesting. Creamy wash of pearl mask, so I got low. So I got 10 face masks for around $10, so that is great. And I will always have use for them. I've got a couple and I go through them every single week. So these are my three brushes that I picked up. So I picked up a, so this is just like a domed brush. I think this is like called a large lip liner brush, but I don't know. Mm, the quality seems nice. It, it seems pretty good, still for a dollar. Could be good for like highlighting over here, DVD, quite nice. Always happy to add to my brush collection. I got this other big domed brush. It comes with a protector. It's quite lovely. It's very flimsy. Could be good for highlighter or a little bit of blush or actually like contouring because I like to lay down my like sculpting contour with a smaller brush. And then I picked up this flat metal brush. I got this for concealer, for doing under the eyebrows mostly. Maybe around some lipstick if you're like me and you apply it really, really messy. But yeah, the only thing is that most of the kind of nicer brushes were sold out, or like the more popular ones, they were all sold out, you know. Um, so if you see a brush and you really, really want to pick it up straight away. So also on my travels, I picked up this highlighter by A20. And look at that packaging, actually, it's so cute. And I think this was more than a dollar. So it's like a warm highlighter, I think. It reminds me a lot of the Bobbi Brown brick. So I'm just gonna swirl it. Ooh, it's really soft actually. This is, ooh, you can see it's very gorgeous actually. It's quite a warm highlighter, maybe too warm for me, but I have so many like yellow and pinky ones. Hmm, I'll try that out. Yeah, I'm really happy and it's a magnet class one. So I'm really, really happy with that. I might pick up another one and check it out. Okay, so my last little pooch is this thing. It's full of goodies. So the first things that I picked up are these two sets of nail polish remover and there's 32 in each. I don't actually remember picking these up, but I'm glad I did. Because I hope they work. And I'll let you know if they, if they do work. But they're nail polish remover, I mean. And then I also picked up one charcoal nose strip. I don't... I don't know why I'd pick up one. Maybe they just threw this in. Not sure, but hopefully that does work. So the next thing I got is this little almond lip scrub. 
Ew. Oh, it smells like marriage pen. Oh, you know. But it doesn't feel very... Oh, yeah, actually. It feels quite nice. So that's what it looks like on the inside. Ew, but it smells like marriage pen. <laughs> Next thing I picked up was this thing. This is a macaroon, macaron, whatever you want to call it. It's a thing where you put things into it. I thought it was so cute. Maybe I could put like your pill or daily vitamins or if you're on any sort of medication. That's really cute. Or cotton. I don't know if you can hold contacts. Oh yeah, or like cream. Make your own lip balm kind of thing. Okay, so I picked this lipstick up just for sheer packaging. How cute is that? The bandana thing and the bow on top. This color is in the color six or nine, you tell me. Um, it's kind of like this pinky shade, let me swatch it. Yeah, it's not really that pigmented. You can see it there. It's so smooth. It smells like what I imagine dollar store lipstick to smell like but since it's from Santee dollar but I just love the packaging it's so cute so along with the other lip scrub I picked up this one this is the sugar lip scrub by beauty trends in the flavor peach of course it's in the flavor peach and this actually looks way more promising it's in a little lip gloss thing product let me just test it out Ooh, it really 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 smells like peaches it smells so good oh my god it's really good yeah so you see it's like there it's fine it's fine it's fine I'm actually really excited about that one really cool and it smells like nice so the next thing I picked up are these cool things. I'm sure you've heard of them. These are the lip gloss, lip tattoo, cocktail magic peel off lip gloss. And so the idea of these is that you put a thick layer of it over your lips. And I don't know how long you're supposed to wait. Uh, oh yeah, so you have to wait five to six minutes and then you peel it off and you're left with like a lip stain, which sounds really, really interesting to me. I actually do have the eyebrow peeler so maybe I might actually do a video and try out the peeling products and see so I got two colors so it actually doesn't say what the names are or what the numbers are but I got the orangey one and the pinky one so hopefully I'll show you the inside of the orangey one so this is what it looks like it's like a gel kind of thing oh it's very thick and gloopy Oh, it smells like PVA glue. Like, you know, like kids glue that you used at school when you used to do like collages? Jesus, it smells just like that. So that's what the color is. And um, I'll do a little check back after in a few minutes to see how it's turned out. So, my most like body mode. I picked up eight liquid lipsticks. It's quite excessive. So I picked up two different finishes. I have metallics and mattes. So I will do the mattes first and then the metallics because I've never ever dealt with metallics before my whole entire life. I got two by accident. So I probably was on the AOA page first and picked up this color. And then as I was going through like all of Shop and Say, I probably picked up the color again. Great. So let's start off with the double. This is the color and it's called Bless. Um, it's actually a bit more dusty than it's picking up on camera and these all smell like a weird vanilla biscuit. So that's the color on top of the gel. There we go. It's like a pinky dusty rose and it looks more orangey. But yeah, that's it. Going for the color. Very happy with that. And then the second metallic lipstick is this kind of burnt orange brownie one it's coming up a little bit more orangey it's a little bit more brown in real life and this one is called hero see it on top there that is actually showing true to form 
it's very warm very orangey um i don't know what it'll be like on but if you want a video of me doing swatches of the just the exclusively the aoa liquid lipsticks let me know down below and i will do that for you it'll be super easy so that's it it's i don't know it's like a weirdy scabby color and last but not least are my five metallic lipsticks that i picked up here we are i tried to get a few different colors so there's a few weird ones and then there's a few regular ones that you could wear like you know day to day anyways i'm gonna get started with the swatches of my metallic lipstick really excited for these i hope these turn out really really good so the first one i have is called bella and this is a pink blue reflex one it's quite pretty it's very like candy pink okay so this is bella swatch and there's, I hope you can see the metallic blue on that. I'll wait for this to dry down and I'll show you. But yes, I'm really excited and surprised about that. So the next one I'm going to swatch is this deeper pink, which has a kind of purpley reflex. And this one is called the Appy. Okay. Oof, again, this one is gorgeous. This one is a bit more bluish, purpley. So there it is, this is this one here, as you can see it's quite a bit, it's a little bit deeper, more rosy I guess, there we go, so great, very pigmented, very, I'm super impressed with these. Next one is this purpley unicorny one, this one is called Candy, so this looks like a strange one, this looks like a strange one but I'm excited for this guy. So this one is not as pigmented as the other ones, but it's still pretty gorgeous. Now you see it there? It's a little bit more sheer. There you go. Oh, that's got like a goldy, gorgeous reflex. As you see, the other ones are more blue. Yes, that one's quite nice, but I think it might be too light on my lips. Maybe it's like a lip highlighter or like if you want to do an ombre lip. So the next one is called Forever, and this is a maroony one. And this has a reflex of like orangey nearly with a tiny bit of blue. I feel like a lot of metallics do have a blue undertone. So I'm sorry if the angle slightly changed. My battery just died. So I had to plug it in. But this is this guy here. So this is Forever. And this is quite a lovely one. This reminds me of like dresses from the 90s. Like when your mom would put you in that Christmas maroon velvet dress. This is what it reminds me of. And that's quite lovely. So these are all dried down, so you can see they're metallic now. <laughs> that one, I don't know, I kind of love it. So for my last shade, this one is called called Rogue or Rouge. I don't know why you call it Rouge. I think it's like a black one. Let me swatch it. So this is the last one. This is a black grey metallic liquid lipstick, and I think I'm gonna try it out. freaking love this lipstick it's exactly what you want from a liquid lipstick it's pigmented it's metallic it's not sticky and they're all gorgeous I can I'm sure they're all exactly like this for a dollar this is just a crazy amazing formula I'd 100% recommend them but yeah I love it amazing love it love it love it so I think that's everything. So that is my haul from Shop Messe. I'm probably gonna do another one because I'm absolutely addicted to just buying one dollar stuff and trying it out and seeing how it goes. I will let you know how everything goes down below. Face masks, bronzers, liquid lipstick, the jewelry, everything. Like my little palm. I'd highly recommend the lipsticks. It's, if you're going to go for one thing, go for the liquid lipsticks. And the face wipes I think are gorgeous too. Um, I you can't go wrong with like one dollar jewelry either if you just want to have like a quick summer you know trendy accessory wardrobe I'll try out the face mask see if they're any good see if they break me out hope to god they don't and I'll like all the lip scrubs as well so that's it I think mm. I think I'm gonna go and enjoy all my stuff this is like Christmas Christmas for myself 
Okay, um, leave a comment down below if you've bought anything from Shop Nifty that I have not yet gotten and that you're absolutely wild about. And then I will probably end up picking it up because I just have problems with online shopping. So that's everything from me for now. I should probably give my wallet a little bit of a rest because that was a big loop. And yeah, that's everything. Okay, so I will see you in my next video pretty soon. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go. Okay, bye. 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 Little pom-poms. Okay, bye. 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 Bye.